Everyone good? Yep. Good. All right, I'm gonna draw a card for turn. I'm going to play a card. Um, Snow Covered Island. I'm gonna cast Chrome Mox, exiling Cyclonic Rift. Then I'm gonna tap two for a Sapphire Medallion, and I'll pass. Heck of a start. It's looking strong. Indeed. That's Urza turn two. All right, I'm gonna play combo turn the three, and that's it. Or can you combo off once Urza hits? Uh, no. Like well, in ge- like in some scenarios. Yes. I gotta can. go island. I'm not asking you to tell me what's in your hand. Suspend my just... soul talisman. You go. All right, I will draw for turn. Play force and pass. Oh yes, strong turn one. Indeed. From the green player, I'm gonna draw. Untap land. I know. I will play a surprising scary. It enters the battlefield with two depletion counters on it. Uh, can I use a gun? Thank you. And I'm going to tap two for a lightning greaves, and then I will pass. Mm. Nice. Nice. Sasaza problems. All right. I will play a sea of clouds. And then tap two for an invisible stalker. And that's a pass. Alright, I'll keep, uh, kick down my, uh, here. Um, you play Island, or Plains is my land for turn. Uh, and then we'll go two for Blind Obedience so you're tapped out. I think that'll slow you down a little bit. Pass. Big sad. I'll draw for turn. Just make sure you're not tapping all of those artifacts you're about to make. We'll play a swamp for a talisman of resistance, and we'll pass. All right. Oops. Oh, sorry. Oh, you, you can skip me. As, <laughs> uh, he thought the blind of beans just meant. Oh, you don't get a turn. Need to look. Snow covered <laughs> island. I will cast a jeweled lotus, which enters tapped because somebody. I guess this. Uh, I should have played Lavinia, then I would have entered it all. Dang. <laughs> Sad day. Uh, then I will tap three to cast my commander. Is it resolve? I think it resolves. It comes in tap though. It does. So no. I I do get a construct though, which, which also enters tapped. All the things make them tapped. Aren't you gaining some life too? Uh, no. If I, I start extort it. Right. Okay. That's for when I get my ice crown scepter and kill you with it. Gotcha. Gotcha. That's the point. Or and then I will attempt to equip Lightning Greaves to Urza. <coughs> no response. Cool. I got nothing. All right, and now pass the turn. It's a dangerous, dangerous place to be. Probably should have mulliganed for a little bit faster. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I will play a basic forest. And uh, we'll uh, chip in for one. Yep, I'm 39. Got him. Got him. <laughs> I have, li- I have oh. life if you want life. We all use dice. Okay. All right, on tap, upkeep, I will remove another counter from this sad uh, soul ring. And draw. Um, we'll go blue for preordain. And scratch you draw a card. Uh, we're going to play flagstones of... Trocair or something. Upgraded planes is my uh, land for turn. Um, then I think we'll go two mana for Hushbringer. Mm. Yes. So uh, tap up, keep in draw. ETB is no longer a thing. Um, we will tap three for a Tyros Provisioner. And then I will play the backside of. This Agadine's Awakening. Oh yeah. Mm. Uh, it'll enter, I'll create a treasure. I'm not gonna pay the three to untap it. Um, no, that's tapped. And this is tapped, thank you. So it's my treasure that I will be creating, and I'll pass. Mm. All right, uh, untap. As we generate this treasure, I will then draw a card. It's a card. I will... Oops. Play a snow-covered island, 
and then I will let's see. I'll attack Russell for one, two, three, four, five. Ouch. All right, I'll take it. And I'll pass the turn. Alright, uh, before I start my turn, we're gonna crow some birch. We're gonna grab Temple Garden and the one that checks for two basics. That's also green white. Hmm. Canopy Vista? Canopy Vista. I had to pretend like I had interaction. It looks good, it looks strong. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> were, were you intimidated? I was. I mean, I'm a little bit more there. intimidated by like the 15 blue mana open over here, but yeah, you're. There's not a lot that <laughs> much out. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Just, just four. There's a lot. Yeah. Five, six, seven, seven, eight, eight at least. Mm -hmm. yeah. But your psychonograph is stuck underneath that mox. So <laughs> that is a little bit like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll play a basic. It's island. a touch comforting, not super comforting, just a little comforting. Just think about it. If I put Swat Cypher there, what else is mine? <laughs> That's fair, right? This is very true. We're going to tap four for a market festival on that island. Taps for two extra of any combination of colors. And now we're going to tap it for three, one of them being blue, to put in Estrid's invocation on this forest. As a copy of as a market festival. Cool. I like Astrid's invocation. It is sweet. And me, I right, get you. I'll take one. It's so why I can block it though. No, you cannot. Oh, he's unblockable. Okay. I was like, what am I? Why am I taking this? Do you have a cephalid console in that deck? You should. <laughs> I have a feeling you'd really like it. I go. Good, your go. I don't have many ideas now. Upkeep, uh, or remove my last counter for my soul talisman. Dum dum dum. But you Draw. cast it, right? Yeah, I do cast it. All right. Would you like to counter it? I pass priority. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. The fact that you have like so much mana open makes me want to know what you have. So let's find out. I'm gonna pay I'll four for that. a cataclysm. Oh, what's that one? It says, each player chooses from among the permanents here she controls an artifact, a creature, an enchantment, and a land, and then sacrifices the rest. Oh, that means everyone, huh? Yep, me too. Do you have anything? I pass priority. All right, then. <laughs> I just get to force your hand here. <laughs> Tap for one. I'm going to attempt to spell pierce it. Counter, non-creature, unless I pay two. Um, how badly do we want to do this? Yeah, well, we can just let you counter it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I removed some of his stuff. Your turn to remove some stuff. Fell right into his trap. <laughs> All right, my turn? Yep. I will untap, upkeep, draw. We're going to tap... Um, for Kadama's Reach. Any complaints? Nope. Oh. Seems fair. That's just good old fashioned fair, man. You, you have the EDH any... staple, or sorry, CEDH staple, Kadama's Reach. Yeah. <laughs> no, no one can complain about what you're doing. Right now. No, I'm just doing regular. You just complain in a turn when they please get rock monster. <laughs> yeah. Um, so we're going to do this, and then I'm going to play this as my land for turn. Uh, the mm -hmm. one that comes mm -hmm. to my hand. Just so I don't have to... Two hand. triggers! I'll trigger tireless for two triggers. Tis true. That or tapped. You know what? Don't Why do not? it. Yeah. We better do it. We're gonna play Far Wanderings, and... I don't know why I didn't just play this and shortcut it, but I'm gonna go. Sorry, is there a response? Ramp some more. Uh, no. Okay. Force of will. I'm gonna grab. <laughs> yes, that's the right card. Car right <laughs> card to force. That'll enter tap. This will be cracked, and uh, I will pass the turn. Actually, it'll enter. You, you get a third one. Yep. yep. You'll pass. I'll pass. All right, let's spin the wheel. 
and a shuffle. What are you shuffling for? I uh, activate. Oh, I see. see. Um, and that good? Yep, looks All good. All right, let's see what it is. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's exiled. Good. We like those being exiled. <laughs> Not exiled. Is that an isochron? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Isochron Scepter Boy, has it's... been exiled. Then I will go to my turn. That is quite fortunate. <laughs> I will draw a card. I will tap one, two to cast Rhystic Study. Mm -hmm. We good? No, yeah. but as we're not we, countering it. We, <laughs> we good. We as have no of Rhystic Study. <laughs> uh, I'll remove a depletion counter. Uh, tap my lightning greaves and so one two three five i'm gonna cat activators again and then shuffle you guys think that's sufficient sure uh, it's good enough for me yeah but the, this card this time okay that card all right let's see uh, what uh, this card <laughs> is I'll like that for that. rings of bright heart mm. so i'll cast it and then uh, i'll Move to combat. I think I was right. It comes in tap, oh, wait, by whoa, the way, whoa, whoa, so that you can't tap it later. That's for right. You are correct. I don't know why I was scared to do that. Just, just, just. Lightning Reeves tapping for mana is tripping me out. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> he just taps his boots, you know, like. Boop, boop. They're like Heelys. There's like dirt on the floor. On the, <laughs> you know, <laughs> oh, yeah. the Heelys. No, the no. land is stuck to the boots and he just like summons a little bit from them. Yeah, like, just, power water. <laughs> Uh, then I will combat. I will. Let's see. But do I want to make enemies? I guess. Sorry, Logan. I'm gonna attack Jake. You're attacking me. <laughs> yeah. How many? How many? <laughs> like, like you're, you're good. Dude. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Alright, I got a thirty-three. Seriously, like don't worry about it. It's not good. Okay. Go ahead. I ship the turn. Shift your ass is falling apart. Yeah, the pipes right here in the ceiling when the they're expanding is what's happening. I had a plumber come out and make sure that my house was not just like leaking into this. It's just he's like That would be so sad. It's really annoying though, because I work right here. My wife like flushes the toilets and I hear this for like twenty minutes. You guys will get to experience it with me. Sorry, viewers. <laughs> you get the full HD experience of pipe expansion. <laughs> this is your turn, though. Okay? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Do not Google that. <laughs> <laughs> Do not Google pipe expansion. You will not. Unless that's for you. Then. You'll need to check a box that says you're 18 or older. <laughs> Not if sorry. If you're not eighteen, it's fine. They, they, they <laughs> what they I've heard the up. average age is like over a hundred because people just scroll down and pick a random number. Oh really? <laughs> for their date of birth. All right, this is very difficult. We will tap six of various colors, floating a green. Paying five for Estrid. Are you gonna pay for Rissa? Yep. Okay. Yep. Yep. And then we will use the green and two. <gasps> for all the glitters, also paying. Yikes. Um. So right now that's plusing it for three. Mm -hmm. Combat. Uh. I pass. Sure. Four? 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 Let's see. You can block with Urza, by the way. Oh, you're yeah. right. I could block with Urza. Yeah, you can't. Oh, it's unblockable. Just kidding. Can't block with Urza. Just, 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 Even if I wanted to, I wasn't it. going to. <laughs> just, 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 you're going to take it. I'm at 35. I'd much rather him block right. with Urza than take it. <laughs> Second main, plus a Vestrid. Untap four lands. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Untap six mana worth of lands. Um, and then we will pay three for a Sanctum Weaver. To pay the one. Paying the one. Um, I will play a tapped Hollow Fountain as my land for turn. 
Such a responsible magic player. Go ahead. Paying for Ristic Study. We're doing it, guys. So, moral of the story is you have to pay for Ristic because you don't want me to draw into more gas. 100%. No. All right. I'm gonna, I understand. I also just <laughs> could. That's why I was confident. Some players don't. I'm going to tap one for my Ristic buddy. Oh, uh, look. We were cool. We and then I'm going to pay for your Ristic with my, uh, your talisman. my talisman floating a mana. Um, CDH is fun. <laughs> and then I'm going to tap two for Lavinia. Oh, I ruined my life. I ruined it. <laughs> Or made it better. <laughs> literally literally I, ruined his life. <laughs> and I will pay for the uh, trigger again with my other floating mana. Yeah. Okay. From my. Um, and then I'll pass. Alright. I will untap, upkeep, and draw. Like, Alright. So, no ATBs. Everything enters tapped. And you gotta pay 10 oh, yeah, for play. Can't play free spells. I gotta pay 2 unless you guys draw. And you can't play non-creature spells. Convert a man costs seven or larger. Six. Uh, you can play six. But you can not play seven. six. But oh, not seven. I see. Seven or larger. Um, yeah. And that's only non-creature spells for the Esper Sentinel, correct? Uh, yes. Only right. non-creature spells. There's there's no if and it's in here. This is this is actually nerf Destry. Oh. Uh, yeah. Free from the real with that, you totally. Of a large amount of mana. Yeah. Um, He's already making well, a large chain amount Well, also Chainmail and doing what you're normally doing is, you know, that. Then just whatever you want. Uh, five for Gitrog. Here we go. Go ahead. Uh, I will pay the one. And then you have one card in hand. One card in hand. You have three cards in hand. Uh-huh. But I only have four mana. <laughs> I can't pay for all that. All right. We'll pay for all of it, possibly. You can just pay for his. Uh, it's acceptable. <laughs> uh, we're going to pay both for an unmarked grave. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any response? No. Uh-uh. Thumbs all right. up. I, I will lose here. <laughs> No, I can't. I gotta figure out. There's too many uh, stack pieces on the board for me to win. How many cards you got in hand? I have four. Uh huh. The Dakmore Salvage. Wait, it's gotta be. Oh, the non legendary. Yeah, non legendary. And then you go with it. I don't have a discard outlet. And you have four cards in hand. I have four cards in hand. Why do people keep asking me that? It's making me nervous. Just need to know. Because <laughs> it's really yeah. important for me. I'm good. All right. Uh, when Dakmore Salvage hits the graveyard, Gitrog will trigger. Um, mm -hmm. And I will draw a card. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. And then I will play my first land for turn. It's a Fable Passage. I will crack it. When it enters the battlefield, Gitrog will trigger first. I will draw a card. And it will also create two treasures. Thank you. Tap the treasures. Uh, so yes, I draw from Gitrog. And then I go search for... a swamp. And that will enter untapped because I have more than four land. We get to untap. <laughs> <laughs> Can't edit this part out. No. Nope. Can't edit this part. <laughs> I mean, I don't need a forest. What are you talking about? All right, I'll pass. All these permanents that are very pretty, but they're not doing anything. And then I will upkeep, draw a card. One, two, three, four, five, like that. Do that. 
Shuffle. Sure. You want to cut? Sweet. Like sufficiently. Yep. All right, it's an island up by the end. Oh, yeah. Best mana ramp ever. Look at that mana. Tap five. So I may play it, so mm -hmm. I can do that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And Sweet. then... I will pass the turn. I don't want to... Why not? So I think that we should start to be worried about Russell now. Just, just to just some thoughts <laughs> here. It does seem like... <laughs> Things are uh, falling into place. So, um, All according to plan. The Sanctum Weaver so was, cool, dude. and then I realized a huge flaw in my plan. And I'm this is I'm not sure how to get out of drawn This game. It's rough. Yeah. It's too bad, too, because I need you to play non creature spells. <laughs> So I can nope. draw more. Nope. I'm paying. Uh, I have. Uh, you have extra. That's why you're like, wow, you're so responsible. It's like, no, I just have nothing going on. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Well. Oh, get rugs actually tapped. Yeah. So the... Punch him. Okay. <laughs> All right. Not that this changes much. Jake <laughs> is requesting that I punch you. If I request you punch Jake. <laughs> Oh, does that okay. affect anything? Uh, pay one man. Who are you requesting? <laughs> uh, not me. Man. I don't care if it's not me. <laughs> mm. It mm. doesn't matter, actually. I don't think I'm getting conflicting intel. Russell's it, scary. I think if Russell finds a discard outlet, we lose. So if I find a discard outlet and I manage to get a land in my hand, you lose. Well, but you can always dredge your thing to get your land in your hand. So yeah. at the beginning of your turn. You have a draw, which will guarantee that you have a But lane. then I can't draw into it. Well, but who's to say you didn't draw your discard outlet already? It's, true. it's uh, possible. Russell's scary. You're not making, I'm scary. A, you're you're not making not. a good case, dude. Uh, <laughs> you're not making a good case. Here, here, you want me to make but, a case? Here's the case. He can drop Knowledge Pool next turn. I There's could, the case. I could if he has Knowledge Pool. pool. But he's got a pretty good board state. And so do you. I don't know if Knowledge Pool really helps me right here. It'll I need to knock drop me out, but I need to <laughs> I need to drop a cyclonic rift is what I need to drop on my turn. And the other cyclonic rift at the table is hiding underneath a stupid chrome box. You'll never see this cyclonic rift in this game. <laughs> I'm gonna add six to my mana pool. I'm gonna plus up my commander. Nope. And let it all fizzle. I'm gonna move. fizzle it all. Going to end. My turn. <laughs> all right. I tap. I flash in mana burn. <laughs> <Go down. laughs> Draw. Um. Could make a spell called mana burn. That'd be cool. I actually played that Jund lizard on your lock. Yeah, on spell table a couple nights ago. It. It smacks. Yeah. Like uh, that mana burn. All right. Because you. I think that we're gonna be in trouble if they don't do this. I got two oh, mana for a winter orb, and I'll pay the one for Ristic. Oh, I don't think I've ever been more okay with the winter you're, orb. You are in a my very life. good position yeah. for winter orb, which is why you're I didn't also really want to play position it. For winter orb. But, I, yeah. but I'm also in a bad position in general. I do run winter orb. I just it's, it is not know. it's not very good for me, but I think it might keep Russell from uh, going off here. It's my turn. Uh, and sure. I will pass at that. All right. I will untap my green source here. I'll draw two lands, right, or one? Uh, you get to untap one, one land. All right, we're gonna I not play. I was hoping for <laughs> an undergrowth stadium. Oh, there we go. Nailed it. So I'll have two treasures untapped, and this treasure will be tapped from the entry. Okay. Um, oh, did you sack oh, your land awesome. or get tr tr trigger? Oh, I have not. I will sack this land to draw a card. Hmm. What are the chances that you go off here? I will pass the turn. Stuff. All right. That's what I want to hear. Pass the turn. Everybody it was successful. Saying, pass the turn. <laughs> pass the turn. I untap my one tapped land that I used. And I go to upkeep and draw. And then. Warrior. Oh, play Snow Covered Island. 
pass the turn. What the heck? <laughs> Good. That's what we want to hear. Pass. And it's like, I don't even know what to think because uh, there's your cyclonic rift. <laughs> 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 what? I did not ex exhale that. <laughs> Until I'm tapping. I'm going to I have three still. You know what? We're just not even going to do anything yet. Um, minus seven. Mill seven. Oh, and you get all the enchantments. Cool, we hit one. Oh, and that feels bad. Oh, well, not so bad anymore that now that it's ancestral mask. It's an ancestral mask. Yep. And uh we got three lands, Port of the Pages, Wrath of God, Tef's Protection. So that's that's great. Like How many to see that enchantments are there out? Uh five. Wait, does it play for Two, free? Three, four, yes. five. It gets countered. Um, it, it puts, puts it, it, onto, it the puts it oh, onto the battlefield. Good. That's you're right, different. you're right. You cast it. You're good, you didn't did, cast it. Sorry, I didn't know we were talking that technically. That's, um, that's, that that does like, that's it why was, like, this matters, but yours doesn't. Right, right. Okay, I've slowed you down quite a bit. Yes, you have been successful. Okay, so how big is this thing? Big. True, so it's getting plus 15 base. No, because this is for each, each one on the battlefield, so it's also counting that. So, uh, so you're artifacts too? And just that. Just You've got an enchantment. Oh, I have one. JK, so I have one. Okay, cool. So it's a 6-6, six, six, and then it gets plus 14, so it's a 20-20. Two Yikes. turn clock. Yikes. Yeah, I'm relevant now. I <laughs> I'm relevant. <laughs> Mom. Mom, they were scared of me. Okay. <laughs> you know, this is how last time everybody was like, you should hit somebody else, and every time this time, it's ever just dead silent. Don't hit me. Nope. Don't hit me. <laughs> Don't hit me. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to get off on this feeling for one second. <laughs> <laughs> I still think Russ is scary. Jake is annoying. And I'm getting hit. I'm going this way. <laughs> and I'm Jake. <laughs> I'm getting hit. Russ is scary, and I am basically being annoying, and you can't win because of me. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can't kill Jake or you'll win. Yes, don't kill Jake because he has me on. Actually, you can't kill Jake or I'll win too, so. <laughs> I, 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 I'm laying down the rules here. Nobody wins until I'm ready to win. <laughs> You're king making. I'll play my land for turn. That's the beauty of sex. I'm gonna tap six, seven, eight, pay, pay. Play your commander. Recast Estrid for six plus two. Plus two. Plus up. Go to end. Okay. Untap. Go keep draw. Um, I think that I'm going to go two for a mine stone, and I will also pay for the mine stones, uh, and then I'll pass. Uh, on your end step, uh, we will attempt... To beast within the <sighs> I want to beast within your whole board <laughs> but you're gonna that's... waste it on the winter orb um, sad day man sad day I mean this turn this thing's gonna hit you and you're gonna wish you had the beast within and not die to it has X proof actually has you know X proof <laughs> yep I'm gonna hit don't do it Russ Lavinia why would you yeah. hit Lavinia? Yeah. I'm gonna target Lavinia. We're cool. Okay. For a second. Cool. I'll make a 3-3. Three, three. All right. I got a beast. Awesome. All right. My turn. I will untap. Uh, did you pay the one? I did pay the one. I cracked. Did you pay two? Did you pay the one for me? Yeah, you, that would have been five total if you don't oh, want anybody to draw cards. I paid one. Uh, you, it looked like you tapped three for it, but... I had... 
Oh, I had three treasure, but one was tapped. Here, one here. was tapped, yeah. I did not pay for either. And... Look what you did. Oh, this is bad. Look what you did. I should have killed the winner orb instead. <laughs> Look what you did. Was that even worth it? <sighs> probably not. I probably made a mistake here. Oh, I don't untap this. I'm gonna untap this forest. Uh, I'm gonna sacrifice this swamp to the Gitrog upkeep trigger. Draw a card, and then we will draw for turn. What card's in that now? Seven. Mm -hmm. <laughs> cool. Um, That's right, bro. That's where he wants to be. I'm going to cast a Lotus Petal. Are you gonna pay? <laughs> pay the Pied Piper? <laughs> yep. I don't you want got to cast to... this anymore. <laughs> oh, you thought the free spells were free? Uh, actually, you, you, got thought, the, you thought free spells were free? <laughs> you got the Ristic Bros. You, you, got got of, you got Lavinia out, but uh, <laughs> it's, it's not going to do anything. Uh, Are you going to pay worst. the Ristic Bros? Uh, yeah, we're going to pay for both here. <laughs> That's the worst Lotus Petal. <laughs> <laughs> That's the biggest feel bad Lotus <laughs> Petal you've ever seen. Pay two for a tap Lotus Petal. <laughs> uh, I'm going to pay two for an Oblivion Crown. Are you going to pay for me? I will pay for. Uh, you don't have to pay. You don't have to one. pay for that one. But it's only the first one each turn. I will pay for you. I can't. I can't afford you to get something. Any response? It's gonna target the uh, Gitrog monster, or actually the Tireless Provisioner. Okay. Um. This. Okay. This would be a twenty-two. I'm fine with that. You're fine with that? Response? I'm so fine with that. Alright, so play more enchantment. Crown resolves. <sighs> Alright. I'm going to discard a land. Uh, in response to that trigger, I'm going to path your... I think I path the game wrong, right? Yeah, yes. we're gonna path the get rock and I will pay for your your uh Ristic with my mind stone. And then okay. in response, I'm going to pay one to play crop rotation to sacrifice this forest. Put another trigger get rock on the stack. In response. I will pass on that. Oh. Alright, so I will get a drop when it hits the graveyard. So that will go here, and then I will go search for a land. <sighs> we will get... I think I interacted at the wrong time there. Swap. We'll see. I'm not super familiar with how this combo works. I can't remember if he could do the whole thing at instant speed or if he needs... I know that the Lotus Petal is... I wrecked that strategy a little bit. You're slowing him down at least on the infinite meta. Yeah. If he can go off. I messed up already. Good. That's what we gotta so play. We gotta, here. Here. we gotta play these more often. <laughs> oh, this is so bad. Okay, so here's what I should have done. Instead of drawing, which I've already done, he dread. I was supposed dread. to dredge. That was the whole plan, but I, I stupid Russell it brain. And you forgot. Actually, <laughs> here's what we do. <laughs> While I'm searching, this is how we fix it. This is how I fix I, it. I, I'll fix it. Don't worry. I'm gonna get a fetch land. <laughs> That's how I fix this. And then with that draw trigger. <laughs> there you go. Pay one extra life to fix your mistake. Yeah. <laughs> so bad. I'll go get a Marsh Flats. All that for And I'm going to leave this up. here. I'm going to crack it, pay a life to go get this swamp onto the battlefield. All right. And now, with that sacrifice trigger, I'm on 29. With that sacrifice trigger, I will dredge. Okay. Dakmore's right there. The Dakmore. Back to my hand. All right. We got there, team. Okay. And Path is still on the mill stack. Two, you, right? Yeah, so now you mill two as you dredge. Yep. Yes, so I mill two. Splendid drag and exsanguinate. Alright, so hold on. I gotta I gotta collect my thoughts here. So Path is still targeting Getrog. Yep. Alright. Look at him, he's flexing. <laughs> <laughs> is, this, is this like I feel like I'm close. Uh, so I'm gonna discard the Dakmore salvage. I mean his head. To the tireless <laughs> provisioner. Triggering get rog. I will dredge two and mm -hmm. put Dakmore Salvage back in my hand. I'm gonna do this over and over again. 
Every time a land hits the graveyard, I'm going to draw a card. And so I can do this a few times. Mm -hmm. So I hit a land, so I'll draw wait, a card. Wait, 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 you can't do this because... Oh yeah, I guess you can, because you can tap the... You can tap the... the I was thinking your fetch land is threw up wrench and your, your guy would die in between there, but you're good. Okay, so... So this is all still with Path on the Stack. My path, path is still on the Stack. going to win with Path on the Stack, wow. unless somebody has something to say about so, it. So, essentially what this will do, if you guys want me to, I can try to do this. It takes about five minutes to draw my entire deck. Essentially what will happen is, I'm going to keep dredging until I hit a land. Do you have a way land. to get infinite mana do you have, here? Like yes. A, so is there happen, a Titan in there? I can't pay for... There's a Shovel Titan in there. Okay, okay. I can pay... Yes, I can do this. Okay. The first time, you'll be able to draw one more card on my first cast of uh, Dark Ritual. But then all subsequent casts will okay. be able to pay for that, that might change everything, so we'll see. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so is that alright? If uh, So I can keep doing this. Essentially, I'll keep drawing, and then I'll discard. I'll dredge. I'll dredge. If you guys want to see that, I need to actually like do this quickly. So there's one. I'll draw one. When you dredge... Do you draw return one. and then mill, or mill and then return? It's like the same thing, like at the same time. It, yeah, it's a, it's a replacement, replacement effect, effect, so they both happen. Okay. So there was one in there. So you can't tighten away your deck or in your one, deck. One, two, there was one in there. There was two. Well, oh. Gitrog is one at a time, so whenever one or more lands, so even oh. if I dredge two, I only get one draw. So there was one in there, one in there, and essentially it'll happen like this. And then, uh, the oh. then he discards it to this. Right. And, it and we'll see. Anyways. So continue. life, oh no, not life alone. That's not the right one. Nothing happened there. There was a line there. There was a line there. All right, and I'll stop there, because presumably, I guess there is one case. I still have stuff to do. Like I, I still have mana open for counter magic and stuff like that. And so, and so does, do I. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so does Daniel. So you, we had to order this correctly, or yeah. you're gonna get your stuff countered when your time so is I'm in going to on the stack or something. Discard the Kozilek. Uh -huh. So trigger to shuffle everything back in. And I will pass priority on that. Any yeah, good? All mm -hmm. right. So this will essentially get shuffled back in. And then I discard all the lands in my hand to trigger more draws. And essentially, uh, actually these get shuffled in too. All right, so then I would discard this guy. So I have one draw, two draw, three draw, four draw, five draw. We'll have five draw. So. And essentially what this does is essentially I will end up with a deck with all lands and then every time I dredge I'll draw and I'll keep discarding to draw and then we're going to go through the whole process again. If you guys want me to just pick my library, I will. I see. I see, I, I, I see where this is going. I got, like I got can, nothing for this whole process. You can shortcut yeah. to the... So I can shortcut to having my whole deck in my hand yeah. if everyone's okay with that. If everyone wants sure. to interact any time between there? All right. No, because you just respond and keep doing yeah. it if, you, if somebody interacts. So right. I'm pretty sure I played my path at the wrong time. So I will have everything in my hand, and okay, with I everything in my hand... I should my path until you hit your first shuffle trigger, probably. Yeah. Um, I will mm. find... Because then you can't resolve the shuffle trigger and, uh, until right. the, the get wrong dies, that'll stop it. Yeah. But I learned That's my... I, I don't know how to interact with this combo. So, I think you're right, though. I think that is the right way to do it. Yeah. Um, so, if you've got your uh, interaction to kill the Gibrog, interact. Well, first, I gotta cast my uh, my Dark Rit. I could also draw right. you a few cards, but I'm pretty sure it'd kill me. Oh. Here's like, if you let me draw, will that help you win? Uh, I mean, we're both gonna lose right here, so if I let you draw and you stop him from winning, that's the closest chance to winning that I think anybody's gonna get right now. Oh no. Where's my Dark Grip? Did you take it out? We win. Lotus this whole deck is in his hand and the Lotus Petal is tapped. Uh, <laughs> oh yeah. Wait, are you serious? 
<laughs> Wait, did you just cut part of your combo? Well, this is this is that one is, is good. Yeah. But this uh-huh. wreck it. Right. Right. It's because normally he could just do the lotus petal as many times as you want. I mean, you can sculpt your deck if you want. Yeah, that's that's. Is you've there got a, anything I can you've do? You've got here? a bunch of tapped treasures too, right? No, you don't. Because you only for landfall that you get the tapped treasure. Yeah, only landfall. And he's only he's already put his one there. I have like a infinitely big tireless provisioner that I can swing at somebody. We all got blockers. Yep. Oh, this is so embarrassing. How do I not have it? <laughs> I this is like every time I try to combo off and carry <laughs> I kill so myself. <laughs> This feels so bad. <laughs> too, too close to the sun. It's okay. It's a uh, theoretically, if I was a better I mean, player, did I would have get it. I, I must have. Like, it's not in here. I've checked three times. Had I interacted at a better time. So viewers, check our deck list and see if Dark Ritual was actually in Russell's deck or not. <laughs> Guys, need needed both. All right. Um. Well, I will move I to combat. Did, why did you need Lavinia gone, though? He, cause because Lavinia I can't play Lotus Petals. free spells just automatically. Right, right. And it's then once about, that happened, I was like, oh, if you sh- paid mana for it, that's right. Yeah, yeah. so I was like, that's if wild. I shift to Dark Rit, then it will be fine, and I should have done that. And then, anyway. anyway. That's why I I'll move to combat. Things that increase And uh, since I've made you scary, I'm going to swing at you with my 1,000, <laughs> thousand tireless provisioner. Oh. Wh- yep. All right. Up block. That was whack. <laughs> Sorry, T. I'll pass. All right, let's see. I'm, I'm gonna go find to... a dark rate to put in here. <laughs> well, that's so embarrassing. I'm very sad right now. On tap upkeep, I drew a card. But now we get rocking. Gonna use a lastly push to counter surprise and scary, adding five, an extra two, using rings to activate Urza twice. Mm-hmm. Just hope he whiffs. Is that good? That's Simple. good. And uh, let's see. Good, 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 good. Hell yeah. That's what we like. <laughs> I, I will play it since I haven't played a land. <laughs> Again. And then One more, please. <laughs> Just not the tight spout. Ready? Ready? <laughs> <laughs> we did it. I think Logan's gonna win this because oh, you guys have both whipped our <laughs> Now You're Logan's gonna one shot all of us. <laughs> Oh man, this is big sad. This uh, is big sad. Are you will. sure you put spells in your deck? Because I didn't put dark <laughs> I didn't put dark in my deck, so you might not have put your spells in your deck. Oops, all lands. All lands. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Uh you would think. Uh tap two uh three and I'll play a Proteus. Also I didn't have it. Tapped. I missed the paying. Tireless I will pay from the past. Tap that land so it's stuck tapped from my window old. Then I will pass the turn. I didn't remember. Oh, probably uh, winter orb trigger. Winter orb, and then also Estrid's invocation. Oh yeah, you make another uh, one of these things. I can. Or uh, it's eye control. Oh, unfortunately, control. yeah. Or another one of these things. Ah, uh, that'd be I, that'd be no good. <laughs> no more card club. Just come. It would just come in tap too. If I can, and and have something in sickness tapped. Um, the spine obedience is putting a lot of work this game. It's I think that's <laughs> the MVP of this. You got, you got no creatures up, my guy. Right? I is, tell. Is that correct? Yeah, that is correct. Not that it really matters, right? Because you can, word. You're unblockable, so. All right. What am I supposed to do about it? Well, he's gonna put it on the the other friend. Oh, you're. Dryad. We I don't. I don't have time to. You gotta be. No. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's decks. <laughs> Just <laughs> doing them dirty. <laughs> this game. It's insane. The okay. decks now we're recording. So I know. Like, no, you're not gonna be playing well. Today. Make it as embarrassing as possible. All right, combat. Okay. Russell. I deserve this. <laughs> Dang. I deserve this. <laughs> Does that kill both of you? It kills me. It doesn't kill Russell. What is Russell at? How much am I taking? 16. 
I'm taking 16 or a mess? You're taking 16. Okay, so I'll go to 13. And Whoa. last Daniel's got a shenanigans. I have not enough mana, so I will die. Shouldn't have paid for my S for Sentinel. <laughs> Should have let you draw that card. Was that to reorder your deck? This the, one? Yeah. Yeah, okay. you can reorder the deck okay. with that. Okay. But it entered tapped, which that's right. why I couldn't win this turn either. So you're only running Urza? No, there's Tide Spout. Oh, Tide Spout. Oh, tide spout. It's, it's Holebreaker Horror now, actually. Mm. Really? Really? I think Tide Spout's still better. Well, with how many Holebreaker can cast lands, right? No, it can't. No, it can't bounce lands, but, but Holebreaker can counter spells. Counter, counter, technically. can bounce spells back to people's hands. And it also can't be countered. And right? it can't be countered. And it's bigger. I guess with Proteus staff, that doesn't matter as much, but... It doesn't. But I die. Are you done? No. Uh, we're gonna float three mana. <laughs> we're gonna plus up Estrid. To untap. We're gonna take three to mana burn, and that'll be a pass. Alright, untap. Up deep. Bra. Mm. Never placed. That is Dark not Bridge what I needed. I'm gonna count my cards. Can't imagine a single reason I would ever take that card out. If you're gonna like clean up and pick up your playback, <laughs> it's gonna be underneath. <laughs> Alright, I have Jake put it there. <laughs> Jake. <laughs> uh, actually, I think that now Sneaky is. Sneaky cut it for me. Now is the time. I'm gonna pay one and eat my Mind Stone. Tasty. And draw. Gross. Uh, we're gonna go Misty Rainforest. Pay one and uh, go get a island. Probably all she wrote for me. My turn? Indeed. Untap. I get my Lotus Petal. What a worthless card. <laughs> <laughs> well, draw. play here where I don't just die. Let's see, get rock class 7. How did I not put land in my hand other than the deck myself, bitch? I'm a silly goose, guys. Alright. Science that you don't play the deck enough. I don't. That's true. Because it's not allowed at the shop. So I uh, end up not playing it. <laughs> it's kind of where I'm at with this one. I don't play that, enough at the shop. Cause same here. Because nobody wants to play that stack. Why do they just show up? Or hard lock or land destruction. All of it's in here. Yeah, what's wrong with it? Just gotta find the right Three, people to play. Four, five. Alright, I don't think it matters. I think I've. Uh... And then at the same time, they're like, also pack per win. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, we're trying to foster a casual environment. Yep. Come get your prize. Play your team. familiar? This is what I needed last turn. Oh, there uh, are noobs here that you can stop. And then yeah, then they get mad at you. It's a lot. Okay, um, we are not going to do anything with the Estrid's invocation on Oak. and we'll untap our only land. Oh, your ancestral mask is smaller now? Yes. By two? Yes. Two that power. Ben a captive holder. <laughs> Alright. I, like... <laughs> what, how did I not protect my Gitrog the last turn? I am so bad at Dota, or at, Dota, at magic. Did you have it in your hand? Huh? No. I had other things that you I... You thought could... we were playing Dota, huh? That's yeah, that's why. I thought we were playing Dota. <laughs> I'm going to minus. <laughs> so bad. Again. So. Daniel, I'm better than this, I promise. <laughs> Cast your twice. If you're bad, this bad at magic, I don't want to point with you with Dota. <laughs> yeah. He's terrible. I'm pretty Dota. bad at Dota. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. Well, I got everything that searches for enchantments and benefits from enchantments and two enchantments. Everything's an enchantment, right? Oh, no, that's not enchanted. No. All my stuff has hexproof. 
Um, we need a microsynth lattice but our enchant. The fact that this thing has hex is it pretty bummer. You? <laughs> well, that only affects permanents on the battlefield. Oh, my is everything um, in the deck. And I get a deck clue. Deck. Um, All right, here's my request, Logan. Since I stopped these guys from winning, kill Russell first. <laughs> <laughs> um. Well, I don't want. I don't want Russell to untap. So. <laughs> Good. Uh, I like the sound of that. Yeah. So long. Okay. okay. You don't want Jake to untap either. I don't. I, I can't. Do, his stuff is hexproof, and so yeah, it's rough. I think I have no outs. Yeah, no outs. We're gonna tap. Like Sorry, we're getting wood. Stomp some to fair back, but he's playing fairly. He can't stop. Wait, him. isn't the clue tapped? The clue would be tapped. I don't. Okay, but I don't need to tap. He doesn't yeah, need to tap. Oh, it, what so. a play! And not clues a are so good. It's way better than dark ritual. I need to put more clues in here. Oh, oh boy! Oh, it's nice. Oh boy! It's we're almost done. Time. Logan's about to kill everybody else. <laughs> That's unfortunately not correct. That's unfortunate. Okay, combat. Logan's about to kill Russell, and I'm about to go draw a pass, and then he's gonna kill me. Uh, is this unblockable? It's yeah. unblockable, and it's hexproof. Hex and the arrows on it are hexproof. Alright. So you need like. I'm not gonna reveal the silliness in my hand, and I will just take it like a man and die. <laughs> Alright. Second main. Uh, a bunch. <laughs> and then. Color fixing. <laughs> Estrid, paying for Esper Sentinel. What? You don't want to let me draw my one extra, maybe draw Cyclonic <laughs> Rift? What about a uh, Ristic Study? Pass? Up to pass. Untap, upkeep. Cyclonic Rift. Let's see it. Draw. That's not a Cyclonic Rift. Is I also could have won on my last turn if I kept one extra land in that hand where I could have, uh, that I could actually have played. Alright, I'm gonna go two for this Azorius segment. Mistakes made. Brad? And, uh, I think that was the dark a little bit, in this deck. But that wasn't an ice crown scepter. I mean, that's that's a good play, but Death. obviously you uh, we're gonna go got three got for like three chimes. Sure. Yeah. Well, I needed both. I assume you're gonna give me some for the redundancy, right? Yeah. Well, technically, just need lotus petal because you can cycle um, for black and then cycle for green, but right. And then I see, I've wasted I... just black as well. What hits you? I mean, exsanguinates. Oh, you don't have a flyer. But dark red. I don't. Get your okay, I'm gonna hit you for one, so you don't have a full life. Right. That's the reason why it needs to be in there. You got me. Okay, alive. You got me. Whoa. You paid me back for what I did to you on turn two. Yeah, <laughs> All right. Upkeep. Oh, it didn't get We're just going to link that as another ancestral mask onto the stalker. Combat. Yep. GG. Yeah. GG. GG. I, I don't have it. I was one isochron scepter <laughs> short for killing you. Dude. What a game, man. That was crazy. <laughs>